sponsoring this video and I'll give you guys a little bit more details at the end of the video. So it's time for another lower ass workout. Many of you really like my previous ones and you want some new exercises to work on this area. Well, you ask and I'm here to deliver. And this workout is super fun. It only takes 10 minutes of your time. So no excuses. And if you're ready, let's go. 10 exercises, 45 seconds each. Focus on your goals and let's get this done. We're kickstarting the lower belly burn with reverse ab bike. We're doing it slow here for more burn. Exercise. Lie on the floor, hands under or next to your bum, legs lifted as you bend one knee towards yourself and extend the other leg a few inches off the floor. This is just like the reverse motion of riding a bike. Both legs are off the floor during the whole exercise. Try your best to work your lower abs and press your entire back on the floor without arching up. Do it slow and controlled. The closer you extend your leg to the floor, the more it burns. Good work on getting the first one done. Second exercise, we're continuing the burn in the lower abs with leg extension. Same starting position, using the power in your lower abs to lift both legs off the floor. Exercise. Pull both knees in, bending at around 90 degree angle, then extend your legs together straight to a few inches off the floor. Again, our legs are not touching the floor the whole time, but the closer they are to the floor, the more it works the lower abs. If you're a beginner, you can have them lifted higher, no problem, but challenge yourself to lower them as much as possible. You can feel the burn in the lower belly area. That's what we want. No dropping. Keep going. exercise is leg raise to reverse crunch to hit the lower abs in different angles. Same starting position, using your lower abs to lift both legs up perpendicular to the floor. Exercise. Then crunching the abs, lift your butt off the floor, feet pointing towards the sky. Then lower your hip to the ground and legs back down to a few inches off the floor. Again, feet not touching the floor until timer is up. Enjoy the burn. Focus on crunching your lower abs in every rep. Keep breathing, you're doing really good so far. Don't let the burn stop. For our fourth exercise, knee to elbow plank. Start in high plank position, crunching your abs, bring one knee towards your elbow on the same side. This is one rep. Exercise. Alternate side for 45 seconds. Here we're doing it slow and controlled for the ultimate burn. You should feel it in your inner and lower belly for each rep. I know this is tough, I'm dying here but I'll keep going. No pain, no gain. You want the results, you gotta put in the work. Ten seconds, almost there. Hold on. Four down, six to go. Fifth exercise is we up hold. Holds are the best for burn. Tough but effective, so let's get into it. Exercise. Sitting up, contracting your abs to lift your legs up as you reach your arms straight forward to balance yourself. Your body is in a V shape. Hold it there, don't drop. The more you extend your feet towards the floor, the harder it is. Hold it, you're stronger than you think. This is what gives you the lower ab burn, so hang in there, don't give up. We're almost there. Seconds. 
certain. And we're halfway through. Sixth exercise, we're lying back down for flutter kick. This time, we're making the burn more intense but having your hands on your tummy with head and shoulders lifted off the floor. Exercise. As you tighten your abs to raise your legs up and make small rapid up and down scissor leg motions with your legs. By having your head and shoulders up, it helps press your back onto the floor and focus the burn in the lower belly. The closer your feet are to the floor, the harder and more burn it is. I know this is super tough, you can see my legs are pretty high up here as well. Just try your best. If you can go lower, go lower. The key is not dropping the legs to the floor until timer is up. Come on, you can do it. A few more seconds to go. And we're on to our seventh exercise. Windmill to hit our lower abs from all angles for a complete burn. Hands below or next to your bum, lift your legs up with slight bend in the knees. Exercise. Then make a big circle, as big as you can from one side to another. Without touching your feet back to the floor, then rotate back to the other side. You'll feel the burn all around the lower abs from side to center, and that's our goal. You're doing great. Keep pushing, keep making big circles, no stopping. Ten seconds. Another one done. Only three more left. Eighth is leg raise pulses. Exercise. This is similar to leg raise, but instead of lifting our legs all the way from bottom to 90 degree angle, we're pulsing up and down in small motions mid-air. This is definitely harder than normal leg raises but it works even more. The closer the movements are to the ground, the crazier the burn would be. Although even mine are pretty high up, my lower abs are getting very sore at this point, but challenge yourself, see what your body can do. Only two more minutes to go. Ninth is leg raise hold to give an extra burn to our lower abs after the pauses. Basically, hold your legs straight up together in mid-air for 45 seconds. Exercise. Again, the lower they are, the harder it is, and the more burn you get. You get what you work for. <laughs> Hold it, hold it. Just like Chet said, hold it guys, keep your legs down and off the floor. Legs as straight as possible. This burn is going to be worth it. We want flat belly, slim waist, lower abs, then we gotta work for it. No, put, put it back down. <laughs> 20 seconds. Oh put it back down. <laughs> And we're on to our final exercise, V up and down for the maximum burn. Sit up, hands behind your bum, supporting your torso up, raise both legs up with slight bend in the knees. Exercise. Then working the abs, rock your legs up and down while keeping them off the floor. This is so hard, but I said it before and I'll say it again, no pain, no gain. Work and determination is what gets you to success. If it's easy, everyone will have apps. So work hard, believe in yourself, you can do it. 
Only a couple more seconds to go. And we're done. Good job for not giving up. You did amazing. Keep working hard and the results will come. Oh, remember to like, comment, subscribe and press the bell button so you won't miss all my awesome videos coming your way. Bye-bye! Before you go, stretch out the apps and as promised, here's more info about Audible where you can listen to your books wherever you are with the biggest selections of audiobooks ever. Basically, you can listen to it when you're working out, stretching, cooking, walking, or whatever you do. My favorite one recently is Becoming by Michelle Obama. Very often in our busy life these days, we don't read as much, so this has been a great way for me to learn things and listen to stories along the way. Basically, every month you get three free titles, one free audiobook, and two free Audible originals from a changing list. You can now go to audible.com slash emmywong or text emmywong to 500500 to get three months of Audible for just $6.95 a month. That's more than half off of the regular price. Enjoy listening and also hope you like today's workout.